All right, guys, I just want to come in. I'm kind of excited. Guess what came in the mail today? Finally, this took about two weeks. And um, so this is basically a credit card skin that um, I got. And it took about two weeks, almost over two weeks for delivery. Um, it's overseas. I think this may, uh, made in Australia or whatever, whatnot. So um, this is basically a credit card skin. So they have different types now, um, you can make a custom one or they have kind of preset ones. These are preset that I got. Um, and then they also have custom ones where you could upload like a PNG, just make it a really good PNG picture and it upload it and you could write whatever, any kind of, um, design signs, whatever, and upload it. And these guys make it. And then it's just like a sticker that goes on top of your credit card. And they have different credit cards for the European guys. They got the big chip card. And then for the US, they got the small chip card. And they have one without the chip, the old style. All right. So anyways, um, this is basically a skin for your credit card. Um, it goes on the front of your credit card and gives it like, you know, some kind of appealing um, skin. And here's the steps. I'll let you take a look at it. It comes in this little plastic baggie and then it comes in here besides the um, envelope and then um, your skins and that's it. And then let's take a look, put this to the side. So I actually got three of them. I'll show you the other one. And right now, um, so the one I got is um, the white Louis Vuitton one. So it basically comes like this. Mine's a little chip one. So it comes like this and it's really thin. It looks kind of thick at the moment right now. But once you peel the surface and uh, stick it on, it's really thin. And um, the material is pretty good, I would say. Um, I haven't, you know, I just got it, so I don't know how the durability is. I would imagine if you slide it in and out um, on the chip, you know, it would um, it would leave scratches. But it's pretty, it's, it's like pretty good plastic uh, material. Um, it's not like the paper thin sticker ones that get scratched easily. So, um, you know, I might, I, I advise you to get with like a darker one. Um, uh, there's several companies that's doing this. This one actually seems pretty legit. The other ones look kind of shady. Um, this one, it was supposed to be brown background and then like a, a gold monogram, but it turned out to be kind of like a black. I'm not really happy with this one. Um, it looks different a little bit. Um, I'll let you see the inside. So it's basically, it's just like a little sticky adhesive. I believe it's 3M because it says 3M on the back. So 3M is a good company, you know, known brand for that. So this is where it goes. And you can see the adhesive up close all the way around. And so that's basically what it is. And it's pretty thin too. So it will go in the um, little card slot. So I bought these extra ones. Um, I might um, give these out give these away um let me know um so it's basically i got this one and then i got the brown one it's actually a black and brown um combination that and so i already put it on i didn't want to do it on camera but i already put one put it on uh for you guys and this is basically one of my credit cards and this actually is not on the site this is a custom made one that i uploaded the picture of the design that i like and this is um a custom one that um that i uploaded so basically it gives the design of the cut and i uploaded it to show um you know the the whatever design that i wanted and this is the design that i chose and this is what it looks like when you made a custom design so it's basically the same thing as these and this is what it looks like on the card now hold on let me um let me make sure that i don't show any numbers or anything real quick okay so all right so basically all right, so basically this is the back side of the of my MasterCard and um this is what it looks like and this is a US card. So this is the back side of the card and um this is the other side. I know I should have went with like a, you know, like a darker card, but this is the the cashback card that MasterCard has and this is the dark side of the card and let me show you the other side that I printed it on. I mean, a uh, placed it on so basically this is not one of those where you spray the water and then you move it around so you basically want to peel one half of the card so this is the backing of the card so basically what i did was like if it was like on here like this i peeled one half of the card and then i placed it like this 
and made sure like I put my finger here to match it exactly at the tip and then on the other arm. See, that's a good thing about the nails is like you can put your nails in between to get it like a solid state right there. Line it up and then just peel it off slowly and then make sure it lined up like that. That's how I um, put it on there. And let me show you the thinness of it. Okay, so that's basically the thinness of it. It's pretty thin. I mean, it won't, it's not going to add any more bulk to the card or any more weight to the card. It's pretty thin, if you ask me. So it's pretty good, um, thin quality. And the e adhesive on there, as you can see, it sticks on pretty good. Even if I rub my fingers against it and everything, it sticks on pretty good. Um, the quality of the print, um, it's glossy. Um, I would like the images to be a little bit sharper, but, um, you know, it's hard to print on these kind of plastic things. And even if I rub against it, you know, it's not going to, it's not going to peel off the, the, even if I put my nails and scratch it, if you can hear it, it's still good. Um, yeah, no damage on that. So it should last a little bit. Um, I mean, the, the, it was on sale when I got it, um. I forgot how much I paid. It's like each one was like 10 bucks or something like that. Um, custom designs a little bit more, whatever. Um, and sometimes, you know, they got it on sale or whatever. And then they got the chip. Now, it doesn't cover all the way on the chip like that. But um, it's still like, you know, it gives you a good protection to your card. Because sometimes, you know, it gets all scratchy and uh, bubbly once you start swiping it everywhere. And then once you peel that off and put a new type on. And then, um, you'll, you know, your, your car would be, you know, nice and fresh. Um, overall, I like it, man. I give it like an A. If it was the, 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 the graphics were a little bit more high quality, um, and, uh, they weren't like, I could see a little bit of pixels if you look up close, but, um, overall it's in good shape. Let me give you an example of one of the other ones, the white and black one. If I put it on. This will, this will um, be what it looks like. Of course, it's going to be thinner, but it has several layers on right now. That's why. So it looks like that. Um, you can, if you like, you could have the design like, you know, put, you could make it so it's halfway design. So you could just have this part halfway and then the other part, just your card and your card number. So for ones that um, have, my, mine's on the back, but for those with the raised card numbers, you could have it like, so it's like cut half, so it only has this design on the top and then have um, blank on that. But fortunately for mine, it didn't have that. So you could have that kind of design and then put that on there. Or you can um, actually put the numbers on the design itself and you could write whatever you want, um, any picture you want, whatever you want on there. You, um, you could do it and um, you could have it gone like that. So this is what the black and white one looks like. You obviously know you like Louis Vuitton, but you could do any design. You could get the Gucci one. There was like a Gucci snake pre-made set. And then if you like this design, this one was, um, you know, this one's the one that came with also. So this is pretty neat. Um, yeah, definitely. Um, I like, I like the, I like the custom design that I made. So this is definitely going to go in my wallet. I like it. Um, like I said, this is the thinness. It's how it looks like. Give you an up close look of the design and um i would say it's like a medium install you just got to make sure that you it lines up correctly um the only part that didn't um li line up a little bit is that part right there i think the the um the chip part was cut too small or too yeah too too short or something like that and so it doesn't fill up the whole chip same thing on this one it was like they should have uh, let the, the sticker go a little bit closer up to there. So um, they do have a black Amex design and everything. So, um, you know, you could check that out. Some of the, there, there's like very few preset designs, but I would definitely recommend going with like a, a custom design like I did with my card. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy with this um, easy uh, medium install and... Um, I'll see, you know, ask me in the comments later down to Ryan if it lasted um, a while or whatnot. But anyways, that's the end of my review on the, um, the custom credit card skin. And we'll see you on the next one.